Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of December 14th through the 20th. Now, this is a very powerful week because we have a new moon and a solar eclipse on the 14th, and obviously the energy is going to be very strong. So let's just see what we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of December 14th through the 20th. What do we have for Capricorn? What do we have for Capricorn? Justice! Karma! This can be a karmic week. Yes, sir. And there could be, there could, justice will be served. There's obviously a fight, an argument. Maybe the law gets called in. Looks like we have a crash or an accident, maybe. I'm not sure, but it looks like there's something that could be. Um, either way, justice is a card of karma. This is the laws of karma playing out this week. Everything is going to turn out as it should, but there's consequences when we see this card. There are two sides to everything, and the law or karma sees straight through every situation. So somebody, they can't get away with it. Looks like we have an argument here with no resolution in sight, and the law may get involved, or karma. You know, karma. There's karma. Okay, that is, that's karma. So it's going to be a very karmic week for you. Um, there could be news of legalities. There's going to be a need to... Um, Calm yourself down by the looks of things. Uh, remain calm. Uh, you're gonna get. You're gonna get what you deserve. Everything is gonna turn out as it should. So what do we have for Capricorn? Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So this is going to be a week of needing to take back control of your life by the looks of things there's justice here justice is going to be served whether it's good or bad karma works in both ways okay um now that is about a decision you know that justice card is about a decision it's a final decision doing the right thing getting what you deserve so truth truth some sort of truth, being honest and upfront, some sort of truth. Whatever is the truth is, you, you're, you're going to get what you deserve based on the truth. There's no toleration for lies. There's no toleration for lies. A fair and just decision is going to be made. What do we have? What do we have for Capricorn? There. Handshake, a meeting with a stranger that could be important. So you're going to be, I don't know, making an agreement with somebody maybe? V, victory in some endeavor. Bouquet, compliments from an admirer. Thank you, Lord. This looks good. So, victory. You're going to have victory in some endeavor. There's going to be a meeting. There obviously is going to be a meeting with a stranger. I believe that there is. Um, it is going to be important. Now, I'm not sure if it's... I mean, we have victory over here, so that's good. But, this meeting with a stranger doesn't appear that it's going to be harmonious. It may be. It may be. But, it, you know, maybe it, maybe it will be. Um... But either way, this is a decision. It's a final decision. It's about doing the right thing. It could come after a fight or an argument or an accident or something like that. Maybe something happened by accident and now there's going to be a resolution. There is going to be a resolution. Put it that way. Um, it's time to take back control of your life and make sure you control your temper during this time. Um, what do we have for Capricorn? What do we have for Capricorn?
You are going to be receiving some compliments from somebody. And you are going to have a victory. So that's good. Ooh, the magician reversed. So. Oh, that's lack of, of manifestation. It is. So that's not taking action in some way. It's, a, it's failing to take action. There's some sort of manipulation here. We could have a master man manipulator or a pathological liar. Somebody that doesn't tell the truth, but the truth is going to come out. If somebody has been lying, this is a liar. This is a liar. So if you either, you know, I don't know. We have a liar here. Whatever side that's on. I don't know. There's two sides. There's two sides to everything with the justice card. So on one hand, we have a liar. We definitely have a liar. This is a master manipulator. Somebody that doesn't tell the truth. Um, this has been an abuse of power, okay? This is also, you know, no resources or taking action without thinking. So, I don't know if there's a boastful in individual here, a trickster, somebody that is a trickster, somebody that has some sort of hidden agendas that is, I don't know if they're getting caught, you know? Somebody may be getting caught doing something. There's not planned, not planned, unplanned. Woo! Definitely some sort of truth is going to be, be revealed. Okay, there's been some lies. Somebody's been lying and some truth is going to be revealed. Okay? Um, the secret is, is going to come out. This is not going to be hidden. The truth is coming out. Somebody is lying about something about something being their fault or something like this is a trickster the truth is going to come out you're going to need to break free from somebody the moon reversed is deception but this deception is going to be revealed it's not going to be hidden anymore you could be dealing with a gemini it could be dealing with a pisces could be dealing with a libra um all is not as it seems something is about to be shown it's going to become very 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 clear Wow, right around right around the eclipse too. This is going to be a very very powerful week for you, a karmic week. No doubt about it. Truth are, truths are going to be revealed. This is a reality check. It feels like it's some kind of nightmare. You know? This is self-deception. It's sneaky behavior. Somebody's been sneaky. Can't hide. Can't hide the truth. Three of Swords. Oh my God. Three of Swords is heartache, suffering, pain. Somebody is in pain. Pain over a separation. This is this is a painful separation. Suffering. Somebody is, is suffering. And they've been in a state of confusion. They have. They've been confused. They haven't been seeing clearly. They've been in a deep, dark place. They've been manipulating. They've been lying. They've been lying about how they truly feel. They've been lying. They haven't been telling the truth. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth. There's going to be an argument of some sort by the looks of things with that justice card. The truth is going to be revealed. There could be a painful separation that is coming up with that three of swords. There could be. I don't even, I don't know if there's like a third party situation or what. Okay. There could be. There's definitely been some lies. We have somebody here that is very cunning, clever, tricky, sneaky. Um, and you need to break free. You need to break free from this person, whoever they are. Um, but I think there's 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 heartache here. There's there's suffering, there's pain. Grieving, grieving, yeah, a lot of grieving. Um, uh, there could be a rejection. There could be a rejection here. Somebody is getting, being rejected. They're not qualified, maybe, or something like that. Devil! Oh my God! So that is definitely all is not as it seems. There's some sort of greed here. There's a codependency. There's an addiction. There's materialism. There's lust. There's self-sabotaging. Somebody is very unhealthy. They're engaging in unhealthy, toxic behavior. 
And I feel like they're going to get caught. I feel like they're going to get caught. Mmm. Wow, this is toxic behavior. Very toxic. There could be some anger here. Ego as well. So I wonder if there's there's some sort of addiction that, you know, and this is lack of awakening. So if somebody is, is having a hard time, they're, they're, they're really suffering. They're really in a lot of pain over a rejection. Somebody is in a lot of pain over a rejection and they may be overdoing it, you know, self-medicating and overdoing it. So there could, they, they could, something could end in an accident because of, you know, overdoing it, trying to mask the pain, you know, so yeah. I think that th that there's going to be um, some consequences. There's consequences here. There's consequences for behavior. And I think those consequences, I think everything is coming to a head. Somebody needs to break free from an unhealthy behavior. Okay? This is free yourself. Break free from an unhealthy behavior. And this is self-deception. And this one is too. All three of these cards are. Okay, all three of these cards are self-deception. So we have somebody here that is, is like deceiving themselves because they're in so much pain over a rejection. They have to be honest. You've got to be honest with yourself. Don't blame another person for your shortfalls. And this, we do have somebody here that wants to blame, 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 blame. No. So I feel like this week, this is definitely a karmic week. It's a karmic week where somebody has to face their demons. You will be facing your demons. Absolutely. You must break free. You must break free. You need to find those resources within yourself to break free. To break free from some sort of bad habit or addiction or the behavior that you are the ego this is ego it is ego the devil is ruled by ego so somebody's ego and this there is somebody's ego is getting in the way of their of their success anyhow there is some sort of uh consequences with that justice card knight of swords now, the Knight of Swords is a sudden arrival or a sudden departure, okay? It's about being direct, being honest. And there could, like I said, the law could get involved. I wonder if the law is getting involved this week with justice in the Knight of Swords. There could be somebody that is feeling like they are under attack, you know? Um moving too fast as well somebody could be you know for somebody you know if you're if you're doing on drugs or drinking and driving too fast there could be an accident so be careful watch out for that um we have a risk taker here we do we have a risk taker here this is this is somebody that definitely argues a lot very argumentative there could be a dispute there could be a fight but there could be Somebody that is, uh, you know, in a hurry to do something. They're in a hurry and they get themselves in, in an accident. I don't know if, but who that is for. Um, I feel like there's some tension here. There's a lot of tension. Somebody has dug themselves into a hole. They have. They've dug themselves into a hole and it's like they're waiting for somebody to come rescue them. And it, but it feels like they're about to lose something. It feels like they're about to lose something because somebody else is going to get it. That's hard, hard to explain. The sun. Now the sun is happiness bliss 
new day, breakthrough, new beginning. A sudden arrival or departure. Somebody is going to either arrive or depart with that Knight of Swords. There's going to be happiness. This is like the, the Sun card is seeing the light. It's becoming enlightened. Making a very brash move. Or assertive move or whatever it is. This is a new beginning, an, a birth of a new life, the start of a new life. Help is arriving. There is help. There, there is. There is help. There is help. Some sort of help is, is coming. Somebody is going to come to help somebody, to help somebody heal. This is the birth of a new life. It really is. But it comes after somebody faces their demons. They are. Somebody's going to be facing their demons this week. It may hurt. They may receive some painful consequences. I'm just being honest with you. That first card is consequences. This is painful. But the sun card is a warm place. It's happiness. It's healing. It's positive energy. This is freedom as well. Freedom from a toxic situation. So being broken free. Putting plans in action. So I feel as though somebody's going to need to think fast. They're going to need to think fast. Because this is thinking fast. They're going to need to think on their feet. They're going to need to move fast. Sudden. A very sudden decision. Somebody is going to be making a sudden decision. This leads to extreme happiness. Extreme bliss. Great health. Healing. Healing. So this is like a breakthrough. So there's some sort of karmic situation that unfolds that really forces somebody to face their demons. Seriously. To face their ego. But gives them a new lease on life. Do you know what I'm saying? Because this is a new life. And this is the stranger. So there is going to be a meeting with... This is the stranger that arrives. So there is going to be a meeting with a stranger that is important this week. Absolutely. There is. This stranger is going to help you. The stranger is going to help you to heal. Going to help you to heal from this toxic situation. This... This... Uh, whatever it is. Uh, that, that justice card is like an accident. Something happened by accident. But healing is at the end of it. I mean, okay, at the end of it is, is great happiness. Something is about to be revealed that is going to break you free from a deep, dark place. Or a deep, dark addiction, you know, or something like that. You must free yourself. But there's been deception. There's been denial with that magician, reca magician card reversed. You know, I don't know if there's even a thief. You know, there could be a thief here. There's a liar. Somebody's going to get caught. They're going to get caught. They're going to get caught doing something. And getting caught is going to change their life. For some of you, there could be news of a child. There could be, you know, a new child. That's not for everybody. There could be news of a birth or news of a pregnancy with that sun card. There could also be a new love. There could be a new love. 
Um, but this is actually a breakthrough with the Sun card. This is a breakthrough. This is, this is, okay? This allows you to break free. This is breaking free. It is breaking free from a, a toxic situation. So, yeah. This is a very karmic week. Be prepared to, to deal with a uh, situation that causes you to be very upset. I feel like you're, you're going to be very upset with this situation, but it's all because of karma. Karma is, is doing whatever it takes to break you free. You might not understand it, but if you don't have the resources or the ability to see clearly or if you've been in some sort of hallucinary uh, hallucinating you know with these two cards you you haven't not hallucinating illusion okay if you've been in some sort of illusionary state of mind where you have been unable to see the truth of your own actions then this is the week where you're going to see them okay something is going to be seen very 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 clearly um but this is like blaming with that magician reverse that's blaming everybody it's not my never me no 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 well that's wrong okay that's a no you need to change your perception you need to change your mentality somebody here needs to take action to bring success but they haven't been able to because of addictions or codependency or ego or something like that anyhow this is definitely going to be a karmic week so get prepared for uh some sort of i feel like it's a, it's almost like being under attack you know with that knight of swords or a battle or a fight or or uh Coming out of illusion for sure with that moon guard reversed. This is a heartbreaking situation. Seeing the truth. You're going to be seeing the truth. That you have been in. Whatever it is that you have been in denial about. You're going to see the truth. Everything is going to turn out as it should. After you face the law, basically, the karma, the law steps in in some way. Good luck.